Hey, this is Justin Owings from BirthdaySheets.com, uh, the uh, site for all things Vibram Five Fingers, as well as uh, other minimal minimalist barefoot shoes, uh, such as the new lines from uh, New Balance, the MB Minimus, uh, or Merrill Barefoot, or Soft Star Shoes, or Viva Barefoot. Uh, there are a lot of new um, shoes out there that are geared towards the uh, barefoot running and barefoot enthusiast movements. Today I'm going to talk about these guys which are actually from New Balance. They are the NB Minimus Life. New Balance's new barefoot friendly uh, line of footwear is called the NB Minimus and there's a trail, road, and uh, I guess wellness shoe. This is the wellness uh, kind of all-purpose um, or general purpose shoe from New Balance that is geared towards uh, kind of a natural, uh, you know, more barefoot experience while wearing a shoe. So, uh, real quick primer on the idea of barefoot shoes or minimalist footwear is that you want shoes that don't have arch support, uh, that allow your foot to move as though it were barefoot, that provide uh, ground feel uh, so that you're, you're kind of in touch with the earth beneath, beneath your feet. Um, generally speaking, I would say that, that uh, most barefoot shoes or min minimalist footwear uh, would rather be zero drop from heel to toe, meaning they're neutral, and they have a wide. They want to have a wide toe box. Um, so the new the New Balance NB Minimus line, first off, is actually doesn't have a zero. They're not a zero drop from heel to toe. So let me come up close and tell you what that means while uh, I show this show these guys off. Zero drop means that from heel to toe, you have no difference in thickness. And with the MB Minimus line, there is a four, mil, four millimeter heel to toe drop. Uh, and the Minimus, MB Minimus Life is no exception to that, just like the trail on the road. Now, uh, as you can see the MB, MB Minimus Life, let's look, take a close look here. Upper, you get a nice to, uh, size toe box. Here, these aren't laces. There, it's actually a, an elastic that runs a crisscross pattern across the top of the shoe um, that kind of marries this uh, one material and the side material across some uh, real flexible mesh. Uh, and more or less, uh, it's kind of a, you know, uh, unadjustable, I guess. There's no tongue to speak of. Now, that kind of gets at another point about minimal footwear is that, hey, if you're not barefoot, you might as well be close to barefoot. In other words, wear the shoes barefoot. Uh, and that is where these Minimus Life shoes really shine. Uh, when you wear them barefoot, they're, they feel awesome on your feet. There's basically no seams on the insides of these. It's just this smooth, uh, silky smooth spandex or some kind of material uh, that, that just feels really good on your feet. I've been wearing these almost constantly for about a week uh, to, to review them and actually the review for these is, is uh, going to be over at birthdayshoes.com so be sure to check that out for additional uh, close-up photos and full thoughts um, on these shoes. But uh, the MB Minimus Life is super comfortable. It's extremely easy to put on uh, and the sole is kind of a um, it's a foam of some sort. Um, the uh, uh, feel, uh, basically, when you wear these, the ground feel is—it's uh, still there. As in, you're going to get a decent amount of gra ground feel. Certainly not as much as you would get, say, wearing um, KSO uh, Vibrams, where you're going to feel uh, just about everything. But if you step step on a pebble, for example, um, you're going to feel it on, on, in these shoes. Um, it just kind of gives an overall what I would call like a more a more cushy ride than uh, than what you might get with a pair of Vibrams uh, or obviously um, barefoot barefoot you're gonna feel everything. Um, so uh, let me get kind of close up here so you can see what these look like on on the feet. Um, I've already got one on my on my left foot here, uh, but uh, these are super easy to put on. Um, thanks to the, the lack of laces and you have a little heel tab on the back. It's a, an elastic, mater elastic material. It's super easy to slip them on with, with one hand as I've done frequently over the past week. Um, you can see uh, as I'm wearing them, they have great flexibility uh, while, while being worn. 
And let's just uh, say, I mean, I just gotta say, I really like the looks of these shoes. Um, they're kind of minimalist as far as, there's not, they're not super flashy. They got this great kind of light gray, black, white sole. Um, I've actually gotten a number of uh, comments on them from, from random people who just think they look good. Uh, they actually seem to go with just about everything. And as far as like an everyday casual shoe, which is kind of uh, what these are going for, as far as I can tell, life, uh, these are uh, super comfortable. They're great for walking around. I've walked a number of miles in them very comfortably without having any, having any uh, issues. They haven't really noticeably affected my gait in, in any kind of uh, negative way, despite having a slight heel to them. Uh, I mean, it's four millimeters is not really very much, um, but uh, there is there is a heel, so just be aware of that. Um, but the anyways, the MB Minimus Life, in my opinion, is a great addition to the uh, uh, you know minimalist footwear uh, market, and I think that. Uh, that uh, if you check them out or you're looking for kind of a casual wear shoe that is barefoot friendly but um, isn't going to catch as many eyes as uh, our five toed friends, uh, the Vibram Five Fingers, you should definitely check these out. Uh, I like them a lot. I think they uh, think they look great. Wife likes them actually, which is always a plus. Uh, and uh, as far as me wearing them, I'm going to be wearing them a lot. So check them out. This is Justin Owings from BirthdaySHoes.com. Uh, check out the full review on the MB Minimus Life at Birthday Shoes. Um, and that's it for today. See ya.